Hey guys, this is Kevin uh, from SJ Design Studio. Today, uh, we're going to talk about the panorama mode uh, in Samsung Galaxy S4 Zoom. Uh, many of you are already familiar with panorama because many cameras and uh, point and shoot cameras uh, come out with panorama mode built into them. What's nice about the feature in this camera is that it's one of the most stable panorama mode that I've ever seen because many times when you're doing panorama mode, you could kind of see the pictures jumping around and warping and you could see where the pictures are connecting and it's kind of distorted. Uh, but with this camera, the camera really compensates well to your movement and uh, your handshake. So that's a nice feature. One of the nicer features is that you could actually stop where you want to stop. Because in the old days, uh, or older phone or camera, you have to turn all the way around until the camera actually stops. But you could decide where to start and when to stop uh, with this camera. And also, it has a built-in feature where if your hand is kind of moving up or moving down because you can't really be stable all the time, it will tell you, okay, move down or move up depending on uh, where you're shooting. So it will kind of sense your whole frame and tell you how to shoot uh, the panorama mode. Now, I'm going to shoot my entire studio here right now. The thing is, if I were to shoot this with a SLR camera, I really need a wide lens and even with a wide lens I would only be able to cover certain distance but with the panorama mode I could actually cover 360 degrees of my studio so that's a great thing about it I'm sure you can use that for your purpose too so I'll show you how to do it come with me so you swipe the screen you go to the mode smart mode uh, you find the panorama right there, so that's panorama, you aim it, all you have to do is half press the shutter, it will start focusing, you press it all the way, now you're in panorama mode. Now it's starting, you just pan around, right there, and stop, and if you look at the image, starting from the first window all the way up to the last window. Alright, thank you for watching. Happy shooting.